All right, now to see who goes first. Here we go. See what it says. Hey, I got it. Cool. All right, so feel free. Here we go. So this is a, uh, a different take on a brew of mine. Instead of being five color phoenixes, this is is it phoenixes. You are on Ravager Shops, my friend. Hello. What the heck? Okay, cool. But you can see. You can see. All right. Now, I would like to be on the play, as you do. I want to get out before that sphere of resistance on turn one. Who won, who won the thing? I got it. Okay. So, yeah, I guess this is okay. Uh, it's not great. I'm going to keep. I'm going to play a D. All right. This is a... Uh, this is fun. All right, go for it. Cool. I'm going to start off with turn one flooded strand, pass turn. Pearl, okay. Sapphire, all right. Oh, hi, Mishra's Workshop. Five mana all of a sudden. Mm -mm. Nope. Oh, that's all I am, yeah. Um, About to say. He <laughs> did like four in. That's okay, Mark. One day I had like four. four uh, Lodestone Golem is good. Can't choose. Well, what are you choosing? Now, what does it happen to this one? Nothing. It's yeah, fine. Nothing smarter. will happen. Just makes yeah, three mana. You just get a Black Lotus every turn, that's all. Okay, that's it. That's it? Seems good. Alright. Um, that's because it is, my friend. And then, <laughs> then I will pass turn. Alright. Oh, jeez. Pass turn. Dead draws, dead draws. I think I'm losing this game, folks. Strip mine? Yep. Hi, Black Lotus. Jeez. Crucible. Crucible's... Uh, yeah, I'm gonna concede. I see a crucible and a strip mine. I'm gonna concede. Me! Yay! Um, yeah. And if you didn't already know what I was on, this makes it really hard for you to sideboard, because you didn't really see anything from me. No. I know you're waiting on me, so sorry for taking so long. Like you said, you have to get up nice and early. So Nice and early. Oy, oy, oy. You're taking the play? I would like to take the play. Good news is, you're probably going to have me real quick here. Real quick. Hello. Hi, keepable hand. We'll keep it. We'll pretend this is an okay thing. Pretend this is enough. Okay. All right, I'm good. let's do it. Turn one, Faithless Looting. Draw a two, discard two. But I like all of these. Mom. <laughs> let's see. All right, I'm gonna put Lightning Bolt, Young Pyromancer in the yard. It hurts, but pass turn. Uh, All right, what you got? Two uh oh, uh oh. Mana vault. Mm -hmm. Oh, you gotta pay one. That's not mana crypt. Oh man. Yeah, mana vault's the one mana one that gives you three mana. So I have to pay one to play it. Yeah. yeah. All right, so I'm gonna lose two life. All right. Have one floating. Cool. So bad. I've gotten crypt and vault mixed up before myself, so. I understand. Okay. Shout outs to uh, being lucky over here. Shout outs to Lucky, the melee player. Hmm. Yeah. So one floating, I can have this for three? Yep, that'll do it. Load That's stone. a card. All right, pastor. All right, uh oh. Uh oh. Well. Let's kill it now, I guess. It's a one crew D. Bolt. R is dead. Pass turn. That uh, mana vault will hit you for one. Okay. It doesn't get to untap this time. It doesn't get to untap? You have to pay four to untap it, so okay. right now it can't. And if it stays tapped during your untap step, then you take one. Which, you know, totally matters. One mana. So 
Ooh, Wasteland. Basics. Yeah. We got there. Okay, Trinosphere is good. Pass turn. All right. Let's see what I've got. I'm gonna fetch. Go to 19. <clears throat> so anything that costs less than three now costs three. Exactly. Okay. So yeah, Force of Will, cute. Pay three mana. <laughs> and pitch a card and pay a life. It doesn't sound as good when you put it like that. Mm. Oh. Sounds like a like the worst cancel yeah. ever. The only exception, oh, kind of, is Delve. Because Delve originally cost more than three, and you can actually get under three because the Delve cards are counting as part of paying the cost. Gotcha. So, yeah, you can do a treasure cruise through a Trinosphere on one. It's funny like that. Alright. So, cool. Um, going to what? take an extra turn. <laughs> Alright. Cool. On my next turn. Yay! <laughs> So that's just basically draw an extra card. Yeah. Basically, yeah. Play an extra land. Yeah? Well, well, if I had one. <laughs> I would if I had yeah. one. That's I'll pass turn. <laughs> <laughs> so, one, two, three. Go. Alright, taking the one. Yes. Alright. Oh, she's on the base. Oh, they loaded them up. Two. Conveniently, you have the three men. play two cards that have one crow to count for a two? Uh oh. Okay. What you got? Foundry Inspector. Interesting. Okay. And that's gonna be your turn, I'm guessing. Yeah. Since it's still everything still costs three. Mm -hmm. All right. So end of turn. So if it makes it cost less than three, does that? Okay. So, so after this applies after anything that would reduce right. or raise the cost. Okay. So, like, if you had a, a Foundry Inspector as well in your hands, it would normally cost two because you get a Foundry Inspector. But then Trinisphere will say, make it three. Okay, so it doesn't, doesn't really help with this. Uh, Dak Faden, take your Foundry Inspector. You get to keep him? I get to keep him. It's the gain control of target artifact. And it's oh, not to end a turn. Okay. It's just... And Dak's at one, so I'm going to grab a die, and I'll pass the turn. Can't attack. He doesn't have face. I want to cut it so that I'm not accused of uh, cheating if I were to get any harder. <laughs> <laughs> R. R. Come on, 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 R.
Uh, I'm going to swing for three. Got it. All right. I and take then, one point of damage every on every upkeep. Every upkeep until I think, I, I think I missed a couple. <laughs> no, I think we're fine. I think we're caught up. Okay. Um, pass turn. Yeah, lose a life, right? Surely there's a land in there somewhere. That's the hope they like. Not getting any lands. Or uh, mocks or something. All right. Going to three. Pass turn. End of turn. Going to fetch. Go to 18. Going to get a tropical island. Trop. Grab a trop. Trop my trop. Mm-hmm. I've actually got lethal on you here because I'm, I'm going to get it. Oh, there better be a tropical island in here. I swear to God. I did not take them out, did I? Well, I'm a drama card. I swear to God. Oh, no. Folks, I done did goof. I goofed. So, oh, did you fed for something that doesn't exist? It's, it's fine. I'll still make it work because I still have other targets. But there's supposed to be, let's see, one, two. Make sure it's in here. One, two. There's supposed to be tropical islands in here. Three, four. I have four volcanics. I don't have any tropicals. So there's a somehow. I don't know how actually, but somehow I didn't end up putting the tropes in here, which it, which is only relevant for flashback ancient grudge. So since I didn't somehow, we're just gonna get a volcanic island. I still got lethal. I just have to do it in a stupid way. Because I'm an idiot. Alright, cool. Hello. Well, you can see that card that I just dropped is an Ancient Grudge. Mm -hmm. So, come my turn, we're going to draw a card, Ancient Grudge, your Foundry Inspector, and then swing for lethal. Alright, game three. Game Thrizzle. Let's not forget that one. Alright, going into game three. Let's do this. Oh my god. I'll take the play. At least I have chicken. Alright. Here goes nothing. This is okay. This is acceptable. I will keep. Uh, one crow. One crow what? Ooh, hello. Alright. Shops. That'll work. Can we get another turn one lodestone? Nope. Okay, Inspector. Inspector Gadget's good. Ooh, Graft Digger's Cage. That's that's not a lot of fun. Pass turn. Alright. <coughs> going through and going to attempt to take Dex's view. Flooded Strand, Mox Ruby. Hmm. I'm going to pass the turn. It makes this a little bit awkward knowing that I don't have any tropical islands. Because <laughs> I can't go and get green for Ancient Grudge anymore. Which makes Ancient Grudge pretty bad. Alright. Ooh, okay, we've got a response. We've got a response. Mm -hmm. We got a fetch. Okay. You can just shuffle that one in there with it. Thorn and amethyst. Yep. Oh, there's two in there. For that, though, with thorn on the stack so that it's not taxing me here. Grudge your cage. Hmm, okay. All right. Now it's good. All right. Hit me with your best shot. That's another <laughs> inspector. You still have one floating. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna do this real quick just to keep them together. Oh, okay. Sorry. That's cool. All right. That's good. That's all I got. Pass turn. You may want to attack. Come at me. Oh yeah, bro. I'm coming at you. Three. 
Yeah, that one didn't enter this Also, it costs two less now. Things are going to yep. cost two less. That, I hear that's pretty good. Uh, I don't know if y'all know this or not, but we might want to target decks. Only every hand. Just saying. I'm actually going to do this now. I'm going to bolt one of yours. Okay. And then pass turn. Now they just cost one less. Oh. That's all. You gotta do the U. Um, Let me throw you. So. Oh my god. Two, right? It cost yep. me two? It cost one less. One less. So, Cause, yeah. Okay, so I've tapped everything, so one, two, three, four. Yeah, so that you cost got, me two. You got two more floating. Two more floating. <laughs> Ooh, nice. Yeah, that's pretty good. good combat, swing three. <laughs> All right, one, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to fetch. Go to 12. Uh -oh. Folks, this isn't looking good for T1. This is not looking good for T1 over here. All right, let's see what we have going on over here. I don't get the edge. Well, make sure that's. Oh, it's back. It's upside down. Oh no. Oh no. No. Crimes against humanity. Cool. But it was E. I don't have This mana base hurts a lot less than the last one, though. I better. I am at. Uh, if you play any more artifacts after this, I am simply dead. So I'm going to ancestral recall targeting me. Okay. One, two, three. Huh? Oh crap! I didn't see that one, unfortunately. Um, if that card doesn't make a difference, though, I'm dead regardless. But. <laughs> Okay, um, we've got, a, we've got a weird spot here. So I have a Pluted Delta. What I can do here is I can fetch, but remember, I don't have any Tropical Islands, yeah. but this deck is supposed to have a Tropical Island. Okay. Can we treat it just for the purpose sure. of this game? Yeah. All right, cool. I'm going to fetch. I think everybody is. You're playing the main target, right? What is that supposed to be? It's got to be one of the other lands. Tarn? Yeah, he does. He got two of them. How did I do that? How did I mess that up? So it is definitely four yeah, scalding tar. Wait. One. Two blue deltas, two flooding strands. Oh, okay. Okay. I see. I see what it is. Okay. So it's supposed to be four scalding tarns, flooded strand, polluted delta, two tropical islands. Instead, it's two polluted deltas, two flooded strands, and that displaced them. So that's a tropical island. Okay. All right. Uh -oh. okay. I'm not going to win next turn. <laughs> and then I'll pass the turn to you. <laughs> and I'm at the uh, yeah, I don't remember if I counted that or not. Okay, we're, we're good now. We got <laughs> it. Yeah, that one stays tapped till you cast an artifact, which, spoiler alert, you're going to cast an artifact. So this is a tropical island. Makes blue or green. All right, in response, in response, we're going to use the flashback on Ancient Grudge. It still untaps though, right? It'll, it'll still untap, but I might be targeting it. Okay. Um, think, I think I actually have to target it, because that's a 7-7. Seven, seven. Yeah. So now this is gone, and now Lodestone Bellin resolves. Okay. okay. So now we're good. Now we got this. So we still have two floating. Yep. He had a wild card, he was one of these like that. He's like, I'm <laughs> okay. Three, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's pretty good. Uh, we go to combat. Yep. Swing six. Okay. Um. Do I have anything that gets me out of this? Maybe not. Well, on your end step, I'm gonna sack ghost quarter and blow up. Okay. So I saw what the next. Oh, it actually that wasn't it then. Oh, because I had to fetch. Never mind. I had to fetch anyway. Okay. So I'm gonna go and get an island. All right, this makes it pretty unlikely I'm going to find another land, unless I already have one in my hand. Dot, dot, dot. And everything costs three more to play. Exactly. You you got it. Nail on the head. 
Everything costs three more to play. Good God, why? Okay. Oh. Now it's that's a, it makes vintage fair. It does, kind of. Um, All right. Play, that's a trop again. We're not gonna do this. You might okay. A wild well, a I'm gonna play a modern it's label card that is Time Walk, but it's five uh, mana, it's so it's Time Warp. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> it's just straight up Time Warp. Take an extra turn. Oh my God, this is terrible. I'm gonna I'm gonna do it though. I'm gonna spend six mana on. Dak Faden. Okay. I'm gonna steal one of your foundry inspectors. Oh, no. yeah. oh wait a minute. No, if I do that, I lose. Because that's tapped. And it doesn't untap. I think I have to take the Lodestone Golem. So the reason for taking the Foundry Inspector is that it's artifacts you cast. Yeah. So if I take one of it, it's effectively taking away one of your cost reducers. Yeah. But if I do that, I die. So I think I have to take the Lodestone Golem. And then pass turn. Hmm. Now, however, this one is a symmetrical effect, so uh, I'm still getting taxed by the Lodestone Golem I now have. <laughs> Jay, you idiot. Jay, you idiot. Ah. Alright. Uh-oh. What we got? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. I'm gonna go to combat. Yep. Swing six. Block. We're gonna trade. Wait, 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 wait. At whom are you swinging? Me? You, yes. Okay, cool. Absolutely. So I'm gonna go down to one, because I'm taking four here. It's a 3-2 with plus one, plus one. Okay, come on deck. What you got? Well, the good news is... Oh, that's yours. Since Lodestone Golem is gone, that means things cost only two more for me instead of three. Yeah, we got a lot of money. All right. Gonna plus deck Faden. One, two. Um, I have no idea. I think you're too slow. Well, I don't have cash, so it's alright. Come on, step it up. Alright, see you later. Hey, good luck. I'm good. Take care, man. Yeah. You the boss. Good luck, man. Well, I think double preordain is probably pretty bad in this spot, so we're gonna we're gonna discard those. Uh, 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 uh. Okay. This cost you three each in those preordains. Right. You got enough to cast them. Three mana preordain doesn't seem... Uh, I'm gonna say pass turn. I do, but if I cast a preordain, I may not have enough mana for something that preordain would... Is this legendary? No, that one's not. You can do another. That's a good top deck. Well, I mean, you don't have anything to spend it on right now, but still. Yeah, I'm gonna give it a shot. Alright. All right. I'm gonna cast a... Four mana Hercules Recall. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. It's a trust. Nevermore. Okay, so Hercules Recall. Make you return all artifacts you control to your owner's hand. Are these artifacts? No, those are just lands. So, these. But, folks, he's just going to get to cast them right back. Because that's how this works. So, that right there. Yeah. One floating. Yep. Right? Uh, well, yeah. So you spent three on that. You spent three minus one, so one floating. Yep. That's all I can do. Well, you can play one of the, the Spear or the Thorn. Because you have one floating, and this makes it cost oh, one that's less. Right. So, uh, all right, so in response to the Thorn, I may have something to do. I do. I'm going to cast a Manamorphose in response, okay. and I'm going to make its colors red-blue. Draw a card, Jay. Not two cards. Almost drew two cards there. Let's not say we didn't. That would be bad. All right. Okay. We're, we're fine. We didn't epically F up. This is still recording. Okay, thank God. Draw a card. Wait, I, I know what that last card is. Yeah. It's Sphere of Resistance. Sphere of Resistance. <laughs> Resistance. Resistance. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, enough of that, Jake. You know, that's a useless card, so we're, we're not going to care about that. Um, so if I use Deck Fane's Minus here... Oh, 
You can take and have a blocker. Yeah, I'll just trade Dak Faden for a blocker, basically. Well, I don't actually know what's... I think it's better to take the Inspector, I believe is correct. Um, if I'm going to, which I am, so we're going to sack Dak Faden to take your Foundry Inspector. All right. And the Chief doesn't lord itself, so it's... it's These two are trading, yeah. I question... How about we play... Jace, Vryn's Prodigy. It costs three. Oh, uh, Thorn is only for non-creatures. Uh, Normally, yes, you're right, but Jace is a creature. Jace. Yeah. Yeah, I was it had it. And then I will... Oh, Jay, you idiot. Pass turn. That's fine. No, it's fine. We're going to make it work. We're going to make this work somehow. I know there's a sphere and a wild card. Mm. Okay. Uh, in response to the sphere. Sure. Oh, thank you. Tapstart Games has Sushi Go. This game is great. Not sponsored. I just I, I played this game the other day and it's really fun. It's really really fun. Um. Hmm. Well. No, this is Patrick. All right. Actually, I'm gonna say that's. Pass the turn back. Oh well, it's your turn because you cast it. Oh yeah, pass turn. Uh, end of turn. Have you ever seen the SpongeBob SquarePants movie? Yeah. Awesome. Ancient Grudge, targeting Thorn of Amethyst. I had to spend all four mana on it. Alright. Cool! Yo. Are you at Goofy Goober? Draw a card. Discard a land. Transform Jace. Where's my Transform Jace? Oh my god, where's my transform, Jace? Or guys who can't transform Jace. That's how that works. If you, if you don't have the card, you can't transform it. It's a nice order. It's over in the, uh, it's over in this deck. I keep moving him around. He's in here somewhere. Where'd you go, bud? Where'd you go? My goodness, Jace, where are you? Stall for time, stall for time, stall and stalling, I'm stalling for time. Are you at one? He's at one, yeah. 21, story of my life. Oh, sorry. Gotcha. Okay, cool. Here's Jace. Jace at five. The box. The Let's see. Yeah, getting rid of the uh, the scalding tarn now that it does nothing except kill me. Mm -hmm. Seems all right by me, I guess. That seems okay. Doesn't seem like it's gonna do much otherwise. Hmm. I'm going to say uh, minus Jace Telepath Unbound. I believe is correct. Well, yeah, we're gonna minus Jace. Go to two over here, and we're going to cast Ancestral Recall targeting me. I'm going to draw three cards. That's one mana plus the one. One, two, three. Okay. That's fine. These are fine cards. Bulk. Um. Dak Faden. One, two, three. And then the, the tax. Uh, steal your foundry, chief of the no. foundry. Get this one, and then I will um, swing for three, hit you for three, and then on my next, on my main phase two, I'm going to play a black lotus for one mana. 
And then pass turn. It's all yours. Now do I have to flip a nope. coin? Yeah. Oh no no, that's not mana crypt. Because it's not tapped, you don't ha you don't actually lose life. It's only when it stays tapped during your untap. Hello. Wasteland. No wasteland. Your volcanic island. Uh, probably the trop, because that's what's giving me I'm the gonna, green mana yeah, from I'm flashback. Gonna, I'm gonna do that. Okay. Pass so that's turn. gone. There's a tropical island there now. So now, if I wanted flashback ancient grudge, I have to pop my black lotus, which doesn't seem great. <laughs> it's not typically what you want to do. Draw a card. Huh. Huh. Um, for Jace, I'm going to plus to plus. Doesn't do anything, but oh well, I guess. Let's see. Um, we're going to start off with uh, Dak Faden. We're going to plus. Draw two, discard two. Where are you? I've been searching this whole freaking game and I haven't found any of you dudes. What is going on? Man. Alright. Scalding Tarn, Ancient Grudge. Okay. Um. Hmm. That's, that's great. Just what the doctor ordered. <coughs> Alright. Let's try this again. Uh, well. How about... Should probably use this first, actually. Pre So scry two, draw a card. There you are! Now that it doesn't stick and matter. Alright. We're gonna draw this one. Going to play, uh, pop this for green. Black Lotus is popped for green, so there's green, green, green in the pool. Uh, spend green, green on Ancient Grudge, targeting Sphere Resistance. Okay. Spend green on Ancient Grudge, targeting Mana Vault. Because I had two in there and they're both getting flashed back. Flash it back. Um, just careful study. Gee, I know what one of these cards is. It's an Arclight Phoenix. And the other one is a Volk, so that that's going to get to go, I guess. Alright. Um gonna do careful study again. One, two. Uh discard Faithless Looting Young Pyromancer, so that didn't do much. Um YOLO. Careful study. Oh my goodness. Get rid of Scalding Tarn Faithless Looting. Um, go to combat. There is an Arclight Phoenix in here. Okay. So no choice. It has to come back. Because that's how that works. It's going to be six. Yeah, it's... Uh, this one doesn't load itself, but it not Yeah. So nine coming at you. And then... I will pass turn. First quarter. Yep. Pass turn. All right. You got this. Yeah. I uh, do even if I didn't have lethal, Jace can flash back a uh, time walk. Yeah. And that would give me two turns to do it. Well, you, you came from behind. I did. Pretty good. Oh my goodness. To be fair, while the deck is supposed to have the tropical island, if you didn't give me that allowance, I would have lost. Um, but it's supposed to have two tropical islands, six fetch lands, four volcanic islands, two islands, and a mountain. And Mox Ruby, Mox Sapphire, Black Lotus. So, Gravedigger's Cage keeps this guy from being a problem. It also stops Ancient Grudge flashback and Faithless Looting flashback. So, if it gets to stay around, it's really, really good. Um, if. And it also stops uh, Jace Telepath and Bound flashback. That's, but, that's what I brought in, Brian, for those. Good. Took out... Two steel overseers and two hanger back walkers. Fair enough. Uh, for me, I took I took out mental misstep times four because that does nothing in this matchup. That's an easy out. Took out treasure cruise because it's too slow and one of the four force of wills. Um, uh, treasure cruise also is a little bit of a nombo with arclight phoenix. You can get in a spot where you have to exile a phoenix and that's Ooh, yeah. that's not great. That's not where you want to be. So it's it's easier to come out. Cards that came in. 
are I had six shop hates guard or shop hates cards. Shops hate cards. There's a deck vein, one's main board, the other side board, so I'll get the other one out. Where are you? Jeez. <laughs> okay, so Ancient Grudge, one is in the main board, the others are in the sideboard. Uh, Hercules Recall, as you do. Good old Hercules Recall. That was a good Hercules Recall there. Yeah, sure was. There's the deck, the other deck. Yeah, uh, Hercules into Hercules into Hercules. Ancient Grudge. So again, one's main board, the other's side, but that's, that's six cards. <laughs> Jeez. And having... One in the main board made more sense when uh, there were tutors in the deck and in Tomb. Now there's not, but I think there's enough draw power. It's still okay to have one. You do what you could. Shops, sometimes it's a deck that just doesn't let them play, but sometimes it just kind of plays itself. 